So, in the last episode, we took down Lord Benjamin. In today's episode, we are going to carry on here. Now, you might have noticed my gold's been depleted a little bit. I've been around the auction house. Obviously, can't change my deck halfway through a dungeon. But, I'll show you what I bought and I'm bidding to buy in the future. Again, no platinum, just spending gold. So, let's go on and see what's next. Defense E. They still haven't named it. I think this was A, B, and C. And then Defense D and Defense E. Not impressed. Not impressed. There, Lord Alexander. Hello, if there are any human survivors within the sound of my voice, then hold your courage. I am Lord Alexander of Gawain, and your emancipation is imminent. Don't make the same mistake as Lord Benjamin. Be gone. No member of the Triumvirati has ever retreated from an adversary. Is it Triumvirate? I don't know. Today shall not be the first. Well, farewell, Lord Alexander. Okay, so Zealous Charge 2, summon a wounded war hero. Great courage, your troops have speed. With this in mind. Uh, I don't... It's not letting me choose... It's not telling me what uh, the hell shot cast pot and what the castle walls do. Um, so I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. Seeing as it's like Zealous Charge and it's just Wounded War Heroes, I'm going to go with the castle walls. I think you want the cast pot for like things like uh, machinery. Okay. Opponent chose to go first, not letting us look. At these things. Castle, castle wall 05, defensive. Burning oil. Sacrifice this. Target troop being blocked by a castle wall gets minus two, minus two. That can be done three times for free. Interesting. Uh, the hand is awful. Um, there's only one shard in it. So we'll replace it. This isn't much better. Uh, nonetheless, we will go with it. Because it's got a deployment order, so we'll keep it. Lord Alexander goes first. Primal shards. Pure ruby. So Lord Benjamin was uh, sapphire diamond. But Lord Alexander looks like he's just pure ruby. Okay, so we'll play the blood bearer. Okay. There's a Wounded War Hero. A warm one with speed. Ending the turn. So the Burning Oils can deal with three... Can deal with three... Uh, wounded War Heroes. Uh, I'm not going to waste any time. I'm just going to kill this now. Again, I just get the feeling that everything that can be killed should be killed. We've got three burning oils as well, so we can afford to be a bit more liberal. Ah, he is playing diamond. 3-1, inspire. As another troop with cost equal to or greater than this troop's cost enters play under your control, that troop gets plus two, plus zero. It's also a 3-1. Okay. So we're not too bothered. Uh, yeah. So far, so good. We will not attack with the Blood Bearer. Yep. Summons another Wounded War Hero. Then summons a 3-2. This deals double damage. Okay. Uh, so there's another Deployment Orders. Um... So I think that we are just going to kill this. Because that's the one that's giving things massive buffs. And then... We will... Sacrifice this. We haven't got any cards to play this turn. So we'll sacrifice this for two cards. Uh, we'll play another deployment orders. We didn't get... Another troop. Which is really what we were looking for. Nevertheless, we are doing quite well. 
Okay. So we're going to block here. I'm going to let the two in. What's this doing? So in response to that, I'm going to kill this. Yeah, there we go. Whoops. Take one. End the turn. There's another... We've drawn all three of our abominates. That's a problem. We'll attack for three. And then we will... Play... Draw two cards off the deployment orders. There's another shroom tank. But outside of that, nothing. We really need that second wild shard. Yeah, another wounded war hero? Sure. Uh, yeah, we will just take the two. 40 with swift strike, sure. There we go. Now we're in business. Uh, continue to combat. Nothing. End the turn. Yep. Deploy troops you control get plus one this turn. Sure. So, gonna block like this and then kill this with the burning oil and then I'll gain I'll gain two life thanks to the blood bearer uh, really just wanted I've got to get things get a bunny off conky bunny as well uh, yeah, we will play the Shroom Tank. And then continue to combat. Skip combat again. End the turn. He's only got one card in his hand at this point. He's going to summon another Wounded War Hero. Uh, block here. And then block here and block. Here and then can we block with the conky bunny? Rather not. Um, I'm happy with taking in four again. Block uh, conky bunny. Make more battle hoppers. Kill this. Take three. Gain more life. Uh, end the turn. There's a sensei. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven, thirteen, fifteen, seventeen, twenty-one. That should be lethal. It is! Lord Alexander has been defeated. We get 400 gold, 250 experience. Continue. So be it, Shinhair. Forcing my withdrawal only means you shall have to endure the triumvir triumvirate as a united assault. I'm looking forward to it. So, that is all for now. In the next episode, we, I see that this is still yellow, so it's incomplete. So there'll be another battle there. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more. Click on the bell as well for notifications for when a new video comes out. We're also on social media, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Links in the description below. In the meantime, though, I've been JB for just TCG. This has been the Hex Shards of Fate Shinhair Warrior Campaign, episode number 17. And I'll see you in the next one.